All right, I'm going to show you guys a trick I learned the other day, uh, how to compress a picture. This particular picture here of me in this classy shirt, uh, if I go to um, properties, you'll notice that it's 1.66 megabytes. That's huge, and uh, this will make very usable uh, for a, a online document. So uh, what we're going to do is we're going to open up Microsoft PowerPoint. So we go to all programs, go to Microsoft Office PowerPoint, and if we go to insert picture from file, I'm going to locate that picture, which just happens to be on my computer. And uh, there it is. And this picture is huge. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to make it a little bit smaller so that I can uh, make it fit onto this particular slide. Okay. So a little bit smaller. I, what I'm trying to do here is make it fit on this slide right here. Okay. And I'm just going to keep going doing that. Hopefully I can do it. There we go. A little bit too small now, so we're gonna widen it out. I'm trying to trying to keep the same ratio going here, so I'm gonna make it almost identical to what it was. Now if I go to File, Save As, this is what the cool part is. Go to Save As. So it says Presentation. If you drop down, all the way down to JPEG. Yes, you have a JPEG option here. And if I call this, uh, just I'm gonna call it Picture for now. Okay. Now if I do that. And I'm going to save it. Uh, make sure you click on current slide only. Okay, now that I've done that, if I close this, it says, you want to save the changes? Well, I don't really care, so I'm going to click no. But if I go back now, and I go into, uh, and I look at this picture now, and I try to locate it, uh, you'll see it's a lot smaller than it was a second ago. Let me find it. It's in my, my documents folder here. Bear with me. Got to clean these folders out one of these days. It's right here now. Now here's the same picture, and we're going to look at it now, the properties, and it's down to 75.1 kilobytes. So isn't that a great trick? So give it a shot. Uh, you might might want to try this at home. Uh, it's a great way to compress pictures. All right. Hope you find it helpful.